doing a little taxi test. Yeah, I put a different propeller on it, the, a bigger one, so it has more power. I wonder if it's going to have more torque. Oh, I figured I'd take off with the flaps. You have to take off with those flaps? I was thinking about it. Oh, yeah. Because take off, take off flaps, yeah. In the first setting. Yeah. Just to see what it's going to be like. It should go right up with those. Like a few feet. I'm nervous. My hands are cold. I don't know if I want to do this. Go. <laughs> Definitely got some torque. Yeah, it feels like it got more power. Yeah. But... That was a nice clean roll. Yeah. Before you run the battery out, you might want to take a couple passes at the runway to see if you can do it. Yeah. Otherwise, you're going to have to dust off the snow. Now you're in Claremont County. There you go. No water. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, well, to that back wheel really plants. It's just like a P fifty one. Much better. So bigger prop, way more power, still under amps. Yeah. Flops are always good. Unless it's really windy. I was landing my timber without flaps and kind of having crappy landings. And somebody said, you know, you do have flaps. Yeah, see, um, the servos in my Horizon Hobby air tractor, they, they buzz like that, which is fine, but they get, they, they, they like stick and they won't move until you jiggle it back and forth. And if you're in flight and that happens, that's not going to be good.
I mean, a lot of people have said the spec Spectrum servos are shit. Nice plane.